guys welcome back to some more afk arena today we're over on the test server and that is right guys the new patch notes are up patch notes 1.116 which does give us a new light bearer so we thought he might be a um a lot of players were saying a light bearer based on i guess the emblem or the seal that he received so he is going to be the new light bearer hero looks absolutely amazing guys i love the build on him now we did see him introduced earlier when alna was introduced he was kind of the counterpart there and their stories do go together perfectly so it is very cool to see a new light bearer now added a new feature judgment chronicles which would be available after the version update clearing stage 3260 so it is a little bit later ventures can play the feature in the thrilling voyage so they're adding more to the thrilling voyage i believe this is eight that we have in there for the thrilling voyage which is awesome guys it gives a lot of diamonds gives a lot of resources um and it's not super super um intensive time intensive where they can hunt hypogens along with the hershey Hershey inquisition and complete the challenges out of the silent wasteland and launch the limited time event judgment decree which is usually inside that game mode where adventurers will receive additional rewards by completing the, the quest so make sure that you're going in there after a limited event ends the continue uh the condition for unlocking the events will change to clear enemies or 21 so they're going to lower the looks like they're going to lower the um requirement when the enemy's difficulty will also be reduced the battle and the judgment chronicle are in the last survivor format after a battle begins both teams will rotate accordingly to the order of their standby formations we're gonna have to check this out guys this seems completely new um the stages of the judgment chronicles are divided into key stages and normal stages in the first session silent wasteland adventures will battle two bosses the fire daemon and the dust whaler Again, that's going to be pretty interesting. Updated the boss formation for the Nightmare Corridor featuring Shamira is replaced with the Dust Whaler. So they are swapping out some bosses in there. Added the adventure Treasure of Time to the Voyage of Wonder. The Dreamy Garden event will begin soon. Very cool. So again, more loot in there. And then, of course, the Misty Valley. Guys, one of my absolute favorite loot events is the Misty Valley. King's Tower difficulty. It looks like some floors have been reduced. And then usually at that point they do add more tower floors and it looks like bringing the tower floors to 1850 that is right guys which is kind of crazy um faction or it looks like the regular towers are going to 720 as well which again is kind of crazy to think um out of the new athelia harboring harboringer of truth theme narrative video so the second part to this is coming in i know a lot of players weren't super happy with the first part um didn't understand the logic or the reason why it they they killed everyone in there um i guess it was those were actually hypogen worshipers that were coming to dura to actually ask forgiveness there, there's a whole backstory to it if you go through and read it so added a new session of melodic gifts which i know players hate um, will be available a new updated version the event will last for 28 days isn't really event guys you get those little discs those records i think um, for buying things in there and then you can utilize them and and as in here um if you are free to play of course you're not going to have access to any of it so i don't know why they even call it an event and why you have to click it because it has a red exclamation point every single day that they should just go ahead and fix um once the adventure draws the grand prize it will refresh not sure we'll have to check it out and see exactly what it is now the oak in function optimization which i love optimize the display uh, format for the myth mythic quantity furniture in the myth in the wish list and the mythic furniture order okay optimize the display interface add a new notification when a single building floor reaches its limit okay <clears throat> i want to see something in the oak in oak in that is going to show me where the rooms are being worked on um literally if you go let's say to the fourth building on the 10th floor and you go ahead and unlock a room in there you have to track and find out exactly where it is once that room is completed Kind of crazy event calendar function has been optimized optimize the calendar display added a new notification which i like add a new subscription based notification huh that would be um probably something that i'm assuming you have to pay for a subscription based notification subscriptions usually do come with cost athalia and then of course the temple rift fixed a couple issues in there guys so overall not a ton some optimization um the the Mel melody gifts of course are the pay to win we get the second part of the athelia video a couple more floors tower uh king's towers floors i can't speak today uh misty valley is up the dreamy garden event i definitely want to check that one out 
We have a new Voyage of Wonder. Then, of course, um, Shamira is being replaced. A lot of players don't like Shamira, but we are seeing the Dust Whaler, which I don't think we've seen before. And then, of course, this whole entire new part to the um, to the Thrilling Voyage. I don't know if, again, if it's a new section we're going to have to see, but then we also do get the new Light Bearer Hero, guys. All right, so that'll do it for today's video. Let me know in the comments what you guys think, and as always, thank you guys for watching.